Hello and welcome back to Leeds Railway Station. So now it's time for a bit more of an exploration video as I take the line from Leeds to Ilkley. So we're gonna explore the Wharfdale line. Um, I'm gonna try and possibly do it in two parts. So I'm gonna go from here and then end it after Menston or at Burley in Wharfdale. And then I will pick it up from where I left off, of course, until we get to the end of the line. So I will explain more about the line as well as the stations in between. So get ready for part one and welcome to Down The Line. My train arrived into Leeds station in the form of a class 333 and ready for the return journey up to Ilkley, this journey will take around 30 minutes. Okay, so, departed a little bit late, but that's fine. I've got time at my changeover points. Um, just setting off. So, before we get on with the stations, let's give you a bit more information on the Wharfdale line. The Wharfdale line connects Ilkley to cities of Bradford and Leeds, and is solely operated by Northern Trains. You will either see Class 331s or Class 333s along this line, and it gives you some great views of what Yorkshire has to offer. You will notice when you board this train that over the tunnel you will hear it known as the Ilkley train. Our first stop brings us to Guiseley Railway Station, which opened in 1865 by the Midland Railway. There used to be services to Otley along the Arthington to Menston line until it closed under the Beeching Acts in 1965. It was also electrified between 1994 and 1995, and the station reconstructed in 2002. Since 2012, the station here at Guiseley has consistently seen over a million passengers come to the station every year which is great figures for a line like this. The next station is Menston, which was also built in 1865 by the Midland Railway and on this line from Appley Junction to Burley in Wolfdale. From here you could either travel to Ilkley or Otley until the latter closed down. Between 1883 and 1951 a local hospital was served by a half mile long private siding just to the south of Menston Station. It is also planned that Platform 1 is to be extended to allow for longer trains to operate along the line Currently, it offers four carriages and they plan to up it to six. I hope you have enjoyed the line so far, but this is where I end part one and carry back on as we hit Burley in Wharfdale Station. See you in part two.